For ACUsports.com, I'm Grant Boone with volleyball coach Angela Mooney as ACU gets ready for its first appearance in the Southland Conference Tournament. Coach, you go to a road trip against Incarnate Word and Corpus last week, not knowing if you'd make the conference tournament. Now you're going to leave knowing you're three wins away from making it to the NCAA tournament. Take us through the emotions of the last week, finding out that you got that eighth and final seed. You know, after that last match at um, A&M Corpus Christi, we still didn't know whether we were going to be in or not. It was such a crazy year, and there was such a huge tiebreaker procedure that needed to go on that we hadn't heard back from the conference office. After the match, you know, we just talked about how we played and really talked about Corinne because she had a great match and said, you know, Corinne, if this is your final match, way to go out. And You're only senior. For sure. Um, way to compete and way to go out. And I said, as soon as I get word, I'll let you guys know. And it took me kind of gathering my things, going out into this common area, and I got a text from Lance saying, hey, you guys are in. You got it. So ran back in the locker room and told the girls. Everybody started screaming. It was a really exciting time. And I think um, – Having that little bit of adversity the last two weeks has been really good for us. I think um, it's going to be tough from here on out. And so um, being able to have that challenge was good for us. But, you know, getting in and maybe by the skin of our, our teeth is okay. And as long as we're in, we're in. And anybody can win it at this point. So it's ACU, as we've been talking about all year, it's it's the first for every team to make it to postseason play. And, and now you get a chance. You face... The top seed, Stephen F. Austin, when you played them here a couple of weeks ago, you weren't crazy about how your team started, but you really liked how you finished. You lose, you lose three sets to one. Having played them recently and playing in Corpus where you played last Saturday, there there would seem to be, to me at least, a, a, a couple of things in your favor as you prepare. You know what, for sure, I think I love the familiarity that we were just in Corpus and we were just on their court. We were able to practice twice there and mm -hmm. play a match. Um, so we'll turn around tomorrow and we'll practice again. But um, having recently just played Stephen F. Austin, that's just right there in the back. You know, it's right here in our, in our brain. And, you don't have to um, look at film no, as much as you can you say, know, remember that. I yeah. did watch a ton of film yesterday, but um, it's right there. And so it's now more so, do we want to change just a little bit of what we did as far as our scout? And how do we want to defend this person? Or how can we execute better on our side? And because it's so recent and fresh, I think it's easier for us to do that. Um, I am very proud of our team, how they played that third. And even the fourth set of that match. And I think um, having Kate um, back in the rotation will be great. And um, uh, Mary Beth, who hasn't played the last two and a half matches, um, being back in, um, mixing in with Corinne, I think we have a lot more um, options and availability where we really didn't have any kind of availability to make switches or substitutions on the outside in the last three matches. And so having everybody healthy and going again, I think, is great to our advantage. There have been injuries and illnesses the last couple of weeks. And so now full complement. Most important thing Friday, 11 a.m. is what? Um, executing from point one. I mean, we had somebody in, had Lauren Walker, actually, who was just honored as um, honorable mention, but she was in my office just now, and we were talking about getting started from point one, and how does that, how does that feel when you get that big kill first, mm -hmm. and then um, just being aggressive from the very beginning. But you know what? It's about playing our style of volleyball and worrying what about what we need to do on our side and focusing every single point with what we need to do, anticipating what the other team is going to do and respond and converting that into points on our side. Congrats on making Thank the you. tournament. Thank All you right. so much. It is quite an accomplishment. First year of eligibility. ASU is headed to the Southland Conference Volleyball Tournament. First serve against top seed Stephen F. Austin Friday morning down at Corpus Christi at 11 a.m.